Hey, good morning, Shalaria. Today is Wednesday, March 1st. Today is National Pig Day. It's, it's also National Peanut Butter Lover's Day. Peanut Butter Lover. And Mr. Sorkin also has a fun fact for today. I do, and Mr. Uh, Mr. Yusian will be very excited to hear this. Today is Justin Bieber's birthday. Not kidding you. Mr. Yusia has the entire Bieber collection. Hey, Mr. Corey. Nice Mr. Roy is in the house right now yeah, as well. Glad you could come in. So, let's rock. Glad you All could right. make it. We're going to get ready. Today, as you see, uh, I'm Mr. Mitchell. To my uh, left here is going to be uh, Mr. People Skills himself, Mr. Sarkis. We've got to our further left here, we have the fifth best teacher in the social studies hallway, hallway. Mr. McDermott. Yeah, hallway. And then to my right, best beard in the building, Mr. Williams on sports facts, today. Big facts. So let's go ahead, let's get with some announcements. Attention members of Stand Together. Stand together right now. Over me. I was, yeah, I was expecting a little backup there. All right, so going on, there is a meeting going on right now in the Braille room next to the cafeteria. Uh, please make sure to attend so we can part the, uh, we can plan the end of the year activities, and may I say, this is the first announcement to use the phrase, end of the year. End of the year, Woo! that's it. End that's of the year. year activities. A reminder to the cast, crew, and pit of the musical, don't forget to RSVP for the musical banquet by completing the form on Google Classroom and submitting payment no later than 12 noon tomorrow. Scheduling for the 23-24 uh, school year will begin next week on March 6th and will run until March 9th. Our students and parents have been emailed information on the scheduling process that begins next week. Hey, rising seniors, that, that means current juniors, will schedule on March 6th with a makeup day on March 7th. The rising juniors, a.k.a. current sophomores, will schedule on March 7th with a makeup day on March 8th. Rising sophomores, that's you freshmen, will schedule on March 8th with a makeup on March 9th. And if anyone's looking for an elective that's going to be a uh, sophomore, junior, or senior next year, I hear psychology is a really good elective to take, and the teacher's not a bad guy. Really? Yeah. People skills yeah. is pretty good, too. But, um, but Mr. Sarkis, I, I smell something. Uh-oh. <laughs> it wasn't me. I think it was Williams. Oh, oh okay. I, I actually was thinking that it was the smell of maybe some white pizza down in the cafeteria there, oh. because we got a nice lunch report by uh, Mr. Wright here today. Mr. White, so let's take it, to lunch. it away to our lunch report. Hello, Shea Arias, Mr. White down here in the cafeteria. I apologize for any of you that were hoping to see Gordon Ramsay. I couldn't handle the heat, in the heat in the kitchen, so we had to kind of get rid of him. And I'm the better replacement. So uh, for lunch today, right, our main event is chicken bacon ranch wrap. Our pizza of the day is better than Frank's guaranteed barbecue chicken pizza. The soup of the day is lasagna soup. And for tomorrow, we got chicken quesadilla coming your way. All right, so hopefully you guys are ready to have some good lunch. Enjoy your March 1st. Uh, back to the desk. Thank you. I didn't like the Gordon Ramsay comment. I mean, sometimes they use so much oil, the United States military is going to attack. I don't understand why cooking is a competition. Yeah. Let's get on some, some more announcements there, Mr. Sarkis. Hey, that's a great idea. Congratulations to our 2023 PMEA All-Star vocalist, Lauren Lorenz. Max Milligan and Ciara Reese. See you in a nice period there, Ciara. Over the past months, these students have competed in a series of auditions against high school singers from all over the state and have ranked as one of the top vocalist musicians in the state of Pennsylvania. Wish them luck as they prepare to perform with the Allstate Choir in the Poconos during the month of April. Our spring musical, Catch Me If You Can. That's the story of Frank Abagnale, whose father was played by, uh, what's his name? Who am I thinking of? Uh, Christopher Walken. Uh, so the show opens this weekend on Friday and Saturday at 7 p.m. and Sunday at 2 p.m. Tickets range from $13 to $15 and may be purchased by visiting www.showticks.com for you, numeral four, 
letter U.com or by visiting the activities office. New this year, all seats are reserved. Hey, come perform with the Shaler Area Marching Band Auxiliary Teams, the dance team, the Majorettes, and Color Guard. They're hosting an auxiliary camp on Saturday, March 25th from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. in the middle school gyms. Those interested should stop by Activities Office for a registration form. Registration is due no later than this Thursday. That's tomorrow, this Thursday, March 2nd. Um, Mr. McDermott over here was talking about spinning the wheel, uh, but he forgot it was Friday. Um, so we also need to have an announcement here that there's no school on Friday, students. No school. Just keep that in, 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 in remind, remember about that, okay? Um, oh, and finally, one more announcement here. Um, good luck to the students who will be participating in the annual uh, STEAM competition this Friday here at the high school. Many students from all over the Pittsburgh area are going to be here in our high school competing and getting very, very steamy. Um, <laughs> most of them will be coming to the high school to participate in the STEAM competition that our own high school has hosted for at least the past 10 years. We have a weather report there, Mr. Sargent. Do you know who's on the weather report? I do not. I do. It was I... sunny today. And therefore, when it's sunny there, Mr. Esker is the only one that can give the weather report when it's sunny out. Oh, my gosh. Jeez, okay. My he is a lot of people's sunshine around here. Come into fifth period, you'll see. Fifth period cafeteria lunch. Take it away, Mr. Eskra. Good morning, Shaler area. This is your most hated dean east of the Mississippi with your weather report. Today, it is gorgeous, not a single cloud in the sky. It's 50 degrees currently with a high of 67 later on. And of course, all of our cameras are working. So if you ditch school early, we will see it. Again, it's a gorgeous day here at Shaler area. Tomorrow, it will be cloudy, but still 55 with a low of 36. That's it for today, sending it back up to the desk. Thanks, Mr. Esker, for that weather report. As we move on with announcements, uh, I believe we're going to go to counseling here with Mr. McDermott. Who needs a lot of counseling? He's slim, I'm shady. Hi, <laughs> kids. It's me, Mr. McDermott, sixth best teacher in the social studies hallway. Mr. Cooper passed me up. First of all, are you looking for a job this summer? Adrian's Pizza on Thompson Run Road is under new ownership and they're looking to hire. Must be 16 or older, reliable transportation. Uh, must be able to work 12 to 32 hours per week and plus some weekend uh, night shifts. Also, the Pittsburgh Field Club's hiring for all positions and Lifeguards, my former job in high school. Pittsburgh Mobile Concrete, located on Babcock Boulevard in North Hills, is someone else looking for people interested in getting their CDL, their commercial driver's license, and becoming a concrete driver to deliver and produce concrete locally to residential and commercial contractors. Sounds like a hard job. <laughs> Is that a concrete joke? Yeah, I get it. Shaler Area School District is also hiring, looking for workers this summer, Monday through Friday, 8 to 2.30. Pay is 10 bucks an hour, not bad. Pick up an application in the counseling office at the high school. Applications need turned in by April 6th for early decision. Applications will be accepted until May 4th, though. Uh, for information on all these opportunities, please visit the high school counseling office uh, on Google Classroom. And that's all I have for today. For SATV, I'm Senior McDermott. Have a great day. Thanks, Mr. McDermott, for that, that counseling report. I believe it's time for sports, and we only have the, the perfect person to do some sports here. That's Mr. Williams, so we'll send it over to Mr. Williams for your sports report. Morning, Shaler area. It's your boy, Meadville's hardest artist, Corey Williams, here for your SATV Sports Report. Really, no need to bury this lead today. We got the unified bocce team traveling to Gateway High School today for the first round of the playoffs. Shaler area blue 
and White clinch the first and fourth seed positions, so they have to play each other in that tournament and then can go on to win a championship and then go through the loser's bracket and like, there's all kinds of like calculus involved there. I don't really do math very much, uh, so the, let's go out and support our Titan bocce team at Gateway today. Congrats to the varsity ice hockey team who defeated North Catholic last night, three to two. The team appreciated the spirited showing of Titan fans, especially that student section. Mark your calendar for March 9th when the team advances to the next round against, oh, Greensburg Salem. Like, do they have ice out there? <laughs> Is that, it's whatever. All right, then anyways, that's all I have for you in sports today. For SATV, I'm Corey Williams. That's Bill Mitchell. That, that's me. That's yeah. Tony Sarkis. Yeah, Mr. Sarkis. Oh, hey. Hi. Hey, um, yeah. it's been a blast today, uh, Shay Larry. I'm sure well. they won't ask us back, but um, hopefully they maybe we'll sure. see you tomorrow. No worries. They Have a great day. Request to Mr. Myers that I'm back tomorrow in talent two. You look like number two. Get it? <laughs> <laughs>